Hello everyone, welcome to my first, or my second, I mean. So, or actually I mean just restarted, but this is going to be our first official episode. Let's turn the sound a bit. So let's create a new character. This is going to be my first video for Starbound. Well, it's my first official because I took longer than my time on, on, uh, never mind. <laughs> so, I'm going to start with a character creation here. And no, I'm not going to be female. So, my favorite race is the Apex, and I'm really, like, advanced with him. But I might be, I'm going to be someone different this time. So, I don't know about a glitch. Or a male. So, let's go. Um... I'm sorry if you hear me clicking in the background. And now this is the early beta access to start on, as you can see, beta enraged koala. So I well, take forever with the with the create with creating a character. So I'm gonna be in oh that's really good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, so in the next episode, I won't, I won't, uh, I'll make sure that you won't be able to hear the click in the background, so, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like this. This is good. So let's name him. Let's name him Harthy. Or. I don't know what to name him. I think that's good. I'm just gonna do that as a um, a th I don't know, just as a little extra name. Sue's name has some someone in his his thing, his on a species, but. Yeah, so it takes a little bit to load, for me at least. There we go. Spread your, <laughs> spread your wings. So, you have nearly escaped the wrath of the stargazers. Your ship has run out of fuel in orbit of an unknown planet. Before setting out to search for fuel, Search your ship's storage for a matter manipulator. Press E to interact with objects. So yeah, I just accepted a quest. So each each uh, each species have different ship. Uh, sh 
I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but you have the other different ship types. So you know, let me just. It's causing a bit of lag. I guess that's better. So let's open this. So now here's your inventory. You have nothing but. Yeah, stuff. So here's the Madame Manipulator, the Weed Seed, a Broken Phoenix Sword, Flashlight Torches. You just want to grab everything. And you want to put this in. Whichever one of these slots. So shot class. It's time to search a plan for fuel. To survive down there, you will need tools. To produce your, to produce tools, you'll need to make yourself a crafting table. Use your ship's teleportation platform to pre to beam down there. Ten pixels. All right. So now here is your here is your system, which allows you to print things such as the avian flag, but more options will become available as the more you progr progress into the survival situations. And tech, if you find any uh, tech looking chests, you can like, you can equip it in your tech slots here. You can only activate one at a time, so hopefully you'll find a tech sometime. So here's your fuel. It takes coal, but you can turn wood into coal but it takes 10 to make one, so. And here's the uh, chair, or not the chair, the uh, navigation system. So far, we have the alpha sector, but there's the beta sector, the gamma sector, and the X sector, I think. So there's four so far. So there's a whole ton of galaxies and planets you can go to, but it has a cost of. 200 fuel, and yet we have zero. So let's just go down there and get some fuel. In other words, we have to get, we have to complete the quest and get a crafting team and all that stuff. So let's just beam down. Okay, so, whew. Give me a second to arrange my inventory. Later on, like, later on you'll get a pickaxe, so the, but visually, no need to worry about the matter really theater. Oh, it takes ever trees. So this is gonna be how to survive your first night, and now. I'm not really ready to fight monsters or anything. Oh, is this dirt? I don't know if this is dirt or not. It might be. Oh, it's taking forever. Oh, magma rock. So this must be. Uh, oh well. So to quickly access your weapon, hit X. Just dirt. No, it's ash. So probably we must be in an ash biome. Or a volcanic. Oh god, it's creepy. <laughs> oh my god. So indescribable horror. But it must lay low. Well, also, by the way, if you notice, below me there's. or that's, uh. whatever. Uh, iron ore. We can't. we can't get it just yet, so it's just. Oh my god, this thing is so creepy. Okay, so it appears we're not in much luck. 
Ooh. Iron ore at the very top. Alrighty. Should we mine it? No, actually, I'll come back for this another time. Oh, here we are. Some actual dirt. Hopefully, we'll find cobblestone. Ooh. Tree. If that's guys are friendly or not. Uh oh, triple hops. Run! Oh god. Oh, thank god. Okay, so. Let's just take an area for us. All this matter metal theater is going to be really slow. I want to see a little, I mean like little, not like overly large. Because we'll, we'll just leave that to the pickaxe. So to open up your crafting, you hit C. And you can craft an alien flag from here. So let's just get some wooden planks. Let's build a campfire because that's the only, because you, you you need a campfire to stay warm, cause there's such thing as getting cold and dying. Just plop that down right here. Ah, nice warmth. Okay, so now let's just get some cobblestone. Oh, I hear a guy on there. I can't remember how much cobblestone does it take for a stone pickaxe. We'll find out. That's the uh, greatness about crafting. You sometimes when you made it a million times, you can't remember how it's crafted. So we all learn and find out. Oh, I forgot. On my other, on my other pro profile with the, with the apex, there's a um, or on, on my other profile, if you saw on the characters, it said Po Cheeks. That's my really good character. And so I'm so used to double jumping with him. Yeah. So hopefully I can uh, double jump if we find the jump boost tech. Well, first it's a blueprint, but you need to go up to your ship and then equip it. I think there's about enough room for a crafting table. So I hit C to open up your crafting. Oh, it takes 35. <whistles> Set reward. I gotta kill him and we'll get meat off him. Oh, there's plenty of room. So once it's done, you hit E to interact with it to craft things. Metal workstation, we'll get to that later. Molten core. You have to fight an unexpected enemy to get that. So let's see. A wooden bed. Here we are, stone pickaxe. Oh, I just need a little bit more wooden planks. There we go, now things will go a lot faster. Pickaxes are so last millennium. So 
so now you can actually mine a lot faster and get work done rather than just sit around waiting for a tool to just mine up four blocks. So we're going to actually make this part our home. Or this little cave. And also, when you die, you lose a lot of pixels. So you hit E to interact with it, or to craft. The first time around I was playing it, I hit C. Because in Terraria, you hit, you hit the inventory button to use crafting tables. So, yeah. How much is a door? The capacity. A wooden door. Your character looks like a female. There we go. Just make a little staircase. There we go, that's good. Put that there. Let's make a bed. If we can. There we go. Hmm. I think that's good. And this is going to be my first actual video for the channel. I'm going to record in the future, but like probably near the end of this summer, I might not be recording because of stuff like school or like school and everything, military academy and everything. So yeah, it might be a while since I make another video, but I'm going to try to I'm going to try to make as much videos as possible. Also, meteorites come on this planet, like lots, of, like lots of times, or, or um, they come, like, I don't know, they're they're they sometimes come early, but they sometimes come later on, so you want to be careful. So now it's almost the end of night. It's almost the end of day. Let's try and get this food. And f to make to cook food, once you have the raw alien meat, you need to just put it in the fireplace, in the campfire, not in the furnace like in Minecraft, but in the campfire. Oh my gosh, it's really dark. I might die. Ooh. Who has a close call? Alrighty then, let's just kill this guy. Hope he gives us food. Dang, pixels. See, I don't, we didn't really get much food. We didn't really get any food, actually.
So yeah. Oh, give me a second. There we go. So we didn't really get any food, but we didn't get two quests done. So I'm going to have to end the video here and do food next time. Because this video just showed you how to basically survive. So this is, so you're, like, oh wait, in case of meteors, you want to make a much, a thick layer. Let's just get rid of these plant fibers. The quickest way to get them, to get rid of them is to use an axe, which hopefully we can get. Yep, right here. So let's just equip it here. I wonder why I keep jumping is because I'm, I'm trying to get rid of the, oh wait, probably won't. So yeah, there's going to be a thick layer, or yeah. So beds, it's starbound. It's not like well in Starbound if you if like beds are used for healing. They're not used to like sleep past the night. So yeah, um I'm going to end the video here and I will see you guys in the next episode. So, so yeah.